What up, Lurks? Today we're going to be looking at one of the hottest comedians in the game right now, Theo Vaughn. You know, he's been crushing it on the podcast, stand-up scene, really been taken off over the last couple months, and dude's just so random and hilarious. He always catches me off guard, and yeah, he's the GOAT. I've already made quite a few videos on him if you go back and check out my channel, so uh, yeah, let's dive in and see if we can figure out how much money he makes from podcasting. If we come on over to Social Blade, you can see that he's gotten 16.9 million views in the last 30 days, which is really just, even for him, massive. If you come take a look down here at his monthly viewers, for the last two years or so, he was averaging about three, four million views a month, and then within the last couple months, he's really started to take off. September 2022, he racked up 9.4 million views, and February ended up being his best month ever, clocking an insane 16.9 million views. So as you can see, he's experienced pretty steady growth over the last couple of years, but he must have been popping a couple of them blue chews because in 2023, his views are erect. So if we take a look back up here, it shows that his monthly earnings are anywhere from 4.2 thousand to 68 thousand. And I don't know where they come up with that crazy range, but it's safe to assume that comedy podcasts are around the three to four dollar CPM range. So if we take the earnings in the calculator based on the 16.9 million views in the last 30 days, and we put a CPM of four dollars on there, you can pretty much see that's where the top range comes out, this 67.6K. So it's safe to assume he's probably made somewhere around that in the last 30 days. And we got to remember, this is just off of AdSense. So this is not including paid sponsorships within the video or other brand deals associated with the podcast. Theo usually runs four one-minute ads in each one of his podcasts. And by doing a little digging online, I was able to find out how much these companies usually pay to run these ad segments. Prices vary from source to source, but it's only by a couple dollars, so it's safe to assume that these prices are pretty accurate. For a 30-second ad, it's usually about $18 per thousand views. That's what CPM means. If you don't know, it's per thousand views how much you're going to get paid. And it's about $25 per thousand views for a 60-second ad. And if you scroll down here a little bit, it shows that the more viewers you get, for some reason, it looks like the price is a little bit lower. I'm not really sure how that works, but I trust this website. So we're just going to use $20 for this example. And down here, you can see how the prices have changed over the last couple months and years. It looks like they fluctuate pretty frequently, so it's not going to be consistent time over time. And it's very possible that he could just have an agreement for a set dollar amount with all these companies per video, but unless we're his manager or something, we're never going to be able to know that. So we're just going to have to use this model for this calculation. So if we come over to his YouTube page, you can check out all of his latest videos and see how many views they got. I'm going to use his videos from two months old and three months old for this example, because usually after about 30 days is when podcasts or just YouTube videos in general stop really getting a lot of views. So I think that'll be a good average to see how many views and how much money he makes on the first month of the videos being posted. So I did did some calculations for these CPM metrics. He averages 1.6 million views per video for the first 30 days that the video is live. So you divide that by a thousand, you get 1,664. You figure $20 per thousand views, that's 33 grand. Four ads per video, 133 grand. Four videos per month, and you figure he's making 532 grand a year. Now that seems insanely high, so I also came over here and I did what traditional brand deals did. I've looked through a lot of websites for this as well. Usually people are getting around $10,000 for an ad or a shout out with around the amount of subscribers he has. Anything over 1 million to 2 million range is usually about 10,000 per video. So if we look at that, he's making around 40,000 per video and around 160,000 per month. And to me, that seems a lot more realistic. And it may even be somewhere in between these numbers, but I think for this purpose, I'm going to use the 160,000 because that, like I said, just seems 532,000 seems way too much to be dishing out every month. And last but not least, if you check in the description underneath all of his videos, you'll see a link to this Celsius energy drink. And if you notice, he usually has a Celsius sitting out on his counter at all times when he's doing his podcast. So we got to figure he's getting at least another 10,000 from them per video just to have that thing sitting up there and take a sip out of it. In the darkness of the night, a flicker starts to glow. A beacon in the shadows, a light that starts to flow. Illuminating pathways where once there was despair. In the depths of obscurity, hope begins to flare. Like a flame in the wind, I ignite from within. Casting rays of brilliance, Banishing the din With each step I take I brighten up the way In the realm of shadows I become the day I'm the light in the darkness The spark in the night Guiding lost souls Towards the morning light Through the tunnels of uncertainty I'll be the guide For I am the bearer Of hope in me Dreams reside In the labyrinth 
labyrinth of life Where shadows dance and play I'm the ray of sunshine Turning night into day With every glimmer I cast I unveil the unseen In the tapestry of existence I'm the golden sheen From the darkest corners To the highest peak I'm the radiant glow That even shadows seek With every flicker Every beam I emit I dispel the darkness I never submit I'm the light in the darkness The spark in the night Guiding lost souls Towards the morning light Through the tunnels of uncertainty I'll be the guide For I am the bearer of hope In me dreams reside In the symphony of life I'm the crescendo's rise in the canvas of the universe, I paint the skies So let the darkness tremble, let the shadows flee For in the heart of radiance, I'll always be I'm the light in the darkness, the spark in the night Guiding lost souls towards the morning light But every once in a while, so we can assume that brings his total brand deals to around 200,000 per month Okay, so let's add up all his monthly totals for his YouTube earnings. So if we take everything and add it all up, we can figure he gets about 67,000 a month from AdSense, around 120 to 500,000 a month for ad runs, 40,000 a month for brand deals, which all together adds up to a total monthly earnings of somewhere between 227,000 and $607,000. So on a yearly basis, it's safe to say that Theo's pulling in at least $2.8 million, which Shouts out to this man, he's stacking some cash. And I know I didn't include Spotify or Apple Music, but there's no way to see how many views those got, so there's no way to really calculate the earnings he got. But you can assume that he probably made at least another million off of those. So, yeah, this man's ballin'. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this one. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe if you're not already, and comment down below if you have any other video ideas for me. Peace!